Tom Rogers. I run uh, Crab Communications, which is a restaurant PR agency, and an Instagram account called Gourmet Guy, which is restaurant recommendations and where to's, what to do in London. Most of my style is passed down, I think, from my dad and my uncle. It's all about colour. If you're confident with it, your people just like it. And it cheers me up, it cheers them up. I think it's, uh, it's great fun. I dress pretty casual at the office. Uh, it's just jeans, t-shirt. Occasionally, if we've got an event or an award, we've got a good selection of uh, really bright coloured trousers in my wardrobe with a white shirt, something like that, just to make it, you know, make everything stand out again. Three things every guy's got to have. A good watch, a good wallet, and a, a suit that's ideally had a little bit of tailoring done to it just to make it fit properly. This, I'd say, makes you feel like you're on holiday a little bit. It's kind of smart casual, like, you know, pop of colour, nice cream trousers. Although I have got a one-year-old and these kind of trousers with a one-year-old is not a good idea. <laughs> My dad would definitely wear this outfit. It's definitely one of his things. I've uh, adapted his style a little bit, hopefully modernized it where I can. He's got a, a thing with wearing polo shirts with the collar up, which I don't know where that's come from. He does what he wants. I always used to remember him telling me as a kid he'd be invited to someone like a members club and they'd say you have to wear a tie. And dad has collarless shirts specifically, so he doesn't have to and can't wear ties. And my uncle was the same. He would tie a tie in a bow tie. My family have a restaurant that I used to work at in Hammersmith, and I used to dress in completely outrageous colours. People used to think that you'd let a child sort of go through the wardrobe and pick things. I'd have like green trousers, a yellow shirt, pink belt. It fitted with the restaurant that I was at. Good days. I think growing up, you, you, you say a lot of the things your dad does is kind of crazy, or I'd never do that. And now I see myself doing so many things that my dad used to do when I was a kid, either with my son or just, you know, generally. I am, you know, a miniature version of him in a way, and yeah, it's a great thing. My son Oscar was born almost a year ago today. It's a complete whirlwind. He can wear whatever he wants. I mean, I think if he didn't wear colour, my dad would be disappointed as well, so it's kind of a non-negotiable thing in our family. 